like all of you, I'm very happy to be here to officially get this project underway that will make a difference not only for Johnson County, for the entire region of this area of the country, as well as for the entire state of Kansas. It will enhance the safety of tens of thousands of motorists who will travel through here daily, and it will have a very significant economic impact. For a state of inve investment of $21 million in construction costs for this new interchange, there will be a projected economic impact of $620 million to this part of the state. At this point in our economic recovery, that's a pretty significant thing. When people talk about the project, they usually link it to the intermodal facility that's being built just a mile and a half away. But the overall impact and the importance of this project is much broader. Already, non-transportation infrastructure is being built that will allow this area to grow and produce big economic benefits for years to come. And that will increase the traffic, including trucks, by the thousands. The imp this improvement will be pivotal in facilitating that expected growth. No project of this size and complexity can be successfully brought to this point without strong, effective partnerships. And this project is no exception. When the intermodal facility opens, the average daily traffic is expected to be more than 13,000 vehicles, including 3,200 trucks. By the year 2040, those numbers are projected to increase by more than 43,000 vehicles, with 10,300 of those being trucks. That's a lot of traffic, and that's what this interchange was designed to handle. It will enhance safety by reducing the number of conflict points as compared to a more traditional diamond interchange. The design will allow drivers to make unopposed left turns, which is a big safety feature and allows for the smooth movement of a lot of traffic. The groundbreaking of this interchange signifies one of the first important milestones in progress, a progressive growth for the entire southwest Johns County and the city of Edgerton. The completion of the Homestead Diversion Diamond Interchange, the first of its kind in the state of Kansas, will play a pivotal economic role for the community of Edgerton. 